Hi everybody, Amy Love here, and I'm coming on today to um, make a little something. I'm very excited to get a chance to play with this adorable kit by Doreen from Ooh La La Vintage Treasures, and it is called the um, Dainty Darlings Kit. It's so cute. So um, what I think I'm gonna do is I am going to um, alter this envelope but I am going to actually, I think I'm going to make a journal because this kit has me inspired. It's so cute. And I think this is going to actually be on the front of the journal. So I want to decorate this up and I am going to use, um, look at how pretty this is. I'm going to use uh, some of the <laughs> digitals out of the postcard kit. And I'm using some of the ephemera kit and um, some of the bows, because she always has the cutest, cutest bows. So I think um, what I want to do first is I want to add some sari silk, because that's how I want to tie uh, my journal closed. And I have uh, some sari silk from Angel Dream Crafts. And I'm going to make it longer than I know it needs to be, just just to be on the safe side right because I don't know um, exactly I mean I have in my mind how I think it's gonna go but I want to uh, just to go ahead and put some sorry silk down for the tie okay so hopefully that won't be too much in my way and this is the white asari silk she has sorry silk in many different colors so Hopefully that's enough. I think this is the postcard I want to use. It's just gorgeous. And I think I'm going to wait and um, stickle the pieces when they're all um, already put down. So I want to go ahead and ink my edges though. And right now I'm just addicted to this tea dye. Distress ink. I want to put it on everything. I, I go through phases. For a while it was vintage photo. But right now it's tea dye absolutely love it so we're gonna tea dye all the things um, this is the cutest kit I have to tell you I'm just so excited about it so I have and it's I love these colors I just love them and they're it's kind of the same color palette that I was using at Christmas so I have some um, wonderful angel dream crafts uh, embellishments laces and things that match it so well so I'm pretty sure I want to go with this double layer tool polka dot tool trim where are my fabric scissors here we go so I'm gonna do that oh y'all I need to sharpen my scissors so bad okay and then I'm just gonna I'm just gonna glue it we're just gonna hot glue it on down So stinking cute. I don't know if you guys have seen all the other designers working with this kit. Some beautiful creations. I know that uh, Nicola just did a live on her channel where they created just, I only got to see uh, pictures of it because I just didn't have time to watch the live, but it's so cute. I mean, just adorable little creations with this kit. So I'm going to put a link to Nicholas channel below so you can go over and check it out just so cute everybody is just doing such cute cute things oh I wanted to put this in the background and I forgot this yeah I'm scraping the barrel with what I have left of this heart tool fabric from Angel Dream Crafts I do have more on the way, however, because she bought more for the store, and I am absolutely in love with it. So I want that to go there. Now, am I going to glue this down? I can't decide. My hands are so dry. Oh, my gosh. Winter is killing my skin. Um, so everything's sticking, <laughs> sticking to me. It's absolutely crazy. Do I want to put anything else? I don't think so. I think I'm just going to go with that. And I just like to use hot glue for this. Why not? It's 
fast and it works so <laughs> this is so pretty Little, little bit of a mess there. Okay, that's so stinking cute already. Now I am gonna use some of the cute little ephemera. So let me show you the sheets. This, is this not adorable? And then I got this one. Oh. So cute. So I already cut myself out some bits to play with. And I cut out these little boots. Y'all, I can't. Just adorable. And this sweet little hat box. And I want to go ahead and ink those two. Let's ink all the things. I like to ink all the things because it gives everything dimension. And I like that. Just think it looks better. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get this one too. These little hat boxes though. I can't, this kit is just so cute. Although I haven't met met an Ulala Vintage Treasures kit that I didn't like, so it's all cute. Okay. So I know I want to use these. I have this. Isn't this pretty? And I love the colors and I think it matches so well. So I'm thinking about putting that right there. As a matter of fact, yes, I will. Just gonna give it a little in the middle there. Okay. Adorbs. And then I'm thinking the boots and the little hat box right there. <laughs> cute and then I'm gonna come through and I'm gonna stickle some things on that later Up a little bit. it's just adorable adorable all right and then this guy is gonna go right there yes So cute. So now I need to cut off this extra fabric without cutting <laughs> the sorry silk, which honestly, that's the kind of thing I would do normally. But I'm trying to be mindful and not do that while while I'm crafting live with you. All right. Okay. There's. That, and I keep all of these because I love this stuff so much. I will stick it on everything I possibly can. All right, so let me cut this without cutting my doily. Okay. And it certainly doesn't have to be perfect because that's what shabby is to me. And I'm thinking at some point I'm probably going to put some, some text right here. She does have some um, little um, labels somewhere. And I just got to print them out still and decide what I want to put here. But that is so cute. So you will be able to flip it and see this side. Oh, no, I think I have a sneeze. Excuse me. Uh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> So I do want to put something here. Look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? This is another one of the postcards. I think I want to put it right there. Oh, I want to ink it up though. But I might have to cut a little piece off because it is too wide. So I'm going to just trim it a little bit. And then I'm going to keep this really pretty floral strip for something it's too pretty to get rid of and I never cut a straight line I just don't but that's okay <laughs> it's okay 
yeah I'm gonna put that right there I love love these colors have I mentioned that love them I forgot to ink the edges. <laughs> yep, that's how that goes. Man! And I hot glued that down, so there's no... We won't be getting that up and inking the edges, I can tell you that right now. I'm making a whole big mess. Bummer! Well, I just, that's what happens when you get kind of in a hurry. So let me make sure it's facing the right way <laughs> before we decorate it any further. Okay, I do want to use this hat box, so let me go ahead and ink it right now while I'm thinking about it. Well, I should just go ahead and ink the things right after I cut them so I don't forget. Oh, yeah, that would have looked so much better if it was inked. Oh, well. All right, so I have a snippet left of this really pretty lace from Angel Dream Crafts. I love it so much. And I think I want to put it right there. And so I was thinking if I just glue three edges and I left that as kind of like a tuck place. Um, that's what I'm thinking. We'll see if that works out. So I'm just going to glue the three sides. And I'm going to make a glue mess. All right. Yeah. Okay. Excuse me. I have the sniffles. Yikes. that worked out like yeah okay so we'll see if something ends up in there oh I need I missed a spot <laughs> let me go ahead and do it now tend to it now I'm gonna need more glue all right let me get some glue because if I don't tend to it now I'm liable to forget that that didn't glue all the way put under there And then I think that's adorable. This kit is so, so cute. Oh, have I said that 800 times? I'm sorry. <laughs> and I'm gonna put that right there. And just like that, we're at 14 minutes. Are you kidding me? <clears throat> so I am gonna stickle that. And I also got out my, um, Angel Dream Crafts uh, pink bridal trim and um, this applique so I could snippety snip off some bits to add. So I think I'm going to do that too and stickle it, but it'll just attach to the front cover and go across it like this is what I'm thinking. And it's just so, so cute. So I will have a link down below. Uh, to Ulala Vintage Treasures uh, on Etsy where you can get this beautiful digital kit um, Dainty Darlings and I also have a link to Angel Dream Crafts where you can get all the uh, laces and trims that I am using um, also on Etsy so uh, I hope you're all doing well thanks for crafting with me and I'll see you on the next one bye everybody